With a single full charge, the Logitech MX Vertical is going to last you about four months. Four full months with a single charge. The kind of gods. Okay, so what is up guys? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I wanna talk about the Logitech MX Vertical mouse. This is an ergonomic mouse that I basically have been using for about eight months now. And I just wanted to share with you guys the reason why I think this is probably one of the best purchases that you can make for yourself especially if you're somebody who spends a lot of time at your computer and you know you do a lot of video editing or gaming or whatever else work you do at your workstation so basically from around 2017 to late 2018 i suffered really really bad carpal tunnel syndrome and i basically had to wear this girdle everywhere all of the time it was frustrating and I absolutely did not enjoy it. And this was probably mostly because I was constantly using gaming mice at my desk and my hand was constantly angled this way as opposed to the natural handshake position. And that just basically messed up my hand and it really, really hurt all of the time. So I started to research what mice would be great for somebody who had carpal tunnels. And then I found the Logitech MX Vertical. Now, for the most part, I never used this mice the entire time that I had it with the software, but it does come with all these extra features like the Logitech Flow that basically lets you use the mice with three different computers at the same time. And you know, you can switch between three computers and all of that, but I never found use for that. I mostly only use one computer at once and I kept it married to that computer at my desk. Now, one thing that I really liked about the Logitech was the fact that it was really, really lightweight. When I bought it, I was expecting it to be significantly heavier than what I actually got, at least two or three times heavier because of the way that it looked with that graphite design, especially knowing the kind of mice that Logitech has been making for such a long time, I expected it to be heavier, but it wasn't. It was really, really lightweight and comfortable to use. And because of the optical design of the mice, you don't actually have to move your hand over your desk for too long to actually get the mice to move. I mean, the mice have DPI settings all the way up to 4,000, so you're pretty much covered. Now, talking a little bit more about the buttons that you get on this mice, you're going to get a forward and a back button. You're going to get a button at the top for the DPI settings and you can actually hold down that button so that you can fine tune and adjust your DPI settings to suit your taste perfectly. You're also going to get a scroll wheel on a mouse, which obviously is very useful, especially if you're somebody who browses web pages, or maybe you work a lot in Microsoft Excel and Microsoft Word and such, this is going to be a fantastic way to scroll through that. But I think ultimately the winning feature for this particular mice was the ergonomics, the way that my hand felt every time I grabbed onto it. I'm done typing, I reach for my mice. It doesn't feel like anything that's natural and I don't have to re-angle my hand to this uncomfortable position that could mess it up and get me to start feeling pain again. Now, speaking about the battery life of the Logitech MX Vertical, I had it for around eight months and I think I only charged it two or three times. In fact, those times I doubt I charged it fully, but I wouldn't really know because honestly, it doesn't matter. With a single full charge, the Logitech MX Vertical is going to last you about four months. Four full months with a single charge. And if you had the mice die completely on you with a single minute of charge, you can get somewhere around two hours or three hours of use out of it. That is absolutely insane in my opinion. I also believe that the Logitech MX Vertical is the only mouse from the Logitech lineup that you can actually use in wired mode. Basically, usually all the other Logitech mice, when you plug them in, it's basically just charging and it continues to use Bluetooth. But with the MX Vertical, when you plug in the cable that's included, it basically switches over to becoming a wired mouse and you can absolutely use that for your gaming if you want to game with an ergonomic mouse. I hope that makes sense. So gamers don't have to worry about lag or input speed when they're you know, trying to game with the MX Vertical because you can actually still also use it in wired mode. So ultimately, I bought the Logitech MX Vertical so that I never have to wear this girdle on my hand again. And I have basically not had to wear it ever since I actually got the MX Vertical. It's been a fantastic addition to my desk and I absolutely love it. So if you're like me and you had a problem with carpal tunnels and your hand was giving you issues, this would be a fantastic mice to buy to help you alleviate some of those problems and help you reduce your pain. Now, if you have any other ergonomic mice that you'd like to recommend for me to try out, you can leave a comment in the comment section below and I'll be very, very happy to take a look at any other mice that's ergonomic and vertical and affordable that I can get for under $99, exactly like I did with the Logitech MX Vertical that's going to perform like the MX Vertical. I hope that makes sense. 
Thank you so much for watching, and I guess I will see you on another video that will show by Kagan. Peace. Ta -ta!